it's a cup game, yeah, you know what I mean? Anything can happen. It's Scottish Cup semi final time once again. <laughs> What a day is here! Wow! It's cup semi-final day and we are back at Hamden. Oh my god, I am getting a tan out here. <laughs> it is roasting! And who's ready for Celtic versus Aberdeen? This place is mobbed. Look at this, the crowds of the fans coming down. Celtic have the chance to get into yet another Scottish Cup final. The holders from last season, they know that this game this game is pivotal and up against him today is Aberdeen. Celtic, this is their first trip to Hamden this season, remember? The last times we were here, the League Cup semi-finals, the final, they weren't there. Come on up, knocked them out. So as you can see, Celtic fans, this is our first trip to Hamden and they're making well use of it. Wow, what a day it is here. I'm ready to get a tan and take in some Scottish football. Aberdeen are in the way of Celtic. Can they cause an upset or will we see Celtic in yet another Scottish Cup final? Let's go and speak to some fans. What a day it is today, isn't it? Oh, amazing. What a colour guys. Right, last time you were at Hamden, we've seen you prevail, however. You've not been at Hamden this season. We weren't here in the League Cup, so it's the first time here. The Scottish Cup. Is this a must win? Absolutely. Absolutely. This season, absolutely. Got it, yeah. Got it. Two trophies here, we've got to go for it. Definitely. Do you think he's going to do it today? 3 0. Rangers getting bitten, beaten midweek. There's a bit of a feel good factor. The league's obviously in your hands now. Oh, they're shaking. They are shaking. They have had it. They're shaking. The pressure's on them. Come on, us. We've been the same. Win our, win our games and we've won. That's all we need to do. Aberdeen are in town today. How he's been against them this season? It's a cup game, yeah. You know what I mean? Anything can happen. But. I think we will prevail. Yeah. What's the score going to be? 3-0. 3 Is that a day for an Aberdeen upset? Absolutely. 100%. Yes? No, I know. I know. Sure. An easy one. My guy. <laughs> <laughs> What's the score going to be the day, guys? Are we going to do it? 2-0. Aberdeen? 3-1. May you ask your hat trick? <laughs> Mate, that's, a, that's a man the man that Celtic are going to need to look out for. In the very early. Was he? Aye, aye. Anyway. Aberdeen penalties. Yep. 3-0. Super May you that's, I, I was just saying that Mayovsky's the man Celtic need to watch out for. He scored against them twice this season. Could have, could have bought him there. Yep. Never mind, eh? Are Celtic going to win today? Yeah. What's the score going to be? 5 2. 5 2. He's been thinking about that before he went to sleep. What's, what's the score going to be? Yeah, I'll go 3 1 0. 1 0. Love that. Hey, man, put it there. Thank you, mate. Big man, put it there. <laughs> Boys, you can hear the noise Celtic and Aberdeen fans. This is rowdy. Are Aberdeen going to cause an upset today? Yeah. What's the score going to be? And finally, give us a chip review. How good are the chips here at Hamden? Seven out of ten. Do you know what, Hamden? You need to up your stuff. Enjoy the game, guys. Right, I've got my ticket. As we can see, the fans are coming in thick and fast. Hamden is sold out today. And this certainly is going to be an eventful day. Aberdeen, they've not had the best of seasons. But... This is a chance for them to cause a huge upset. This is a chance for them to cause an upset against the Glaswegians that they don't really like. And up against Celtic, the champions, the team that are going for the double. If they could possibly cause an upset against Celtic today, this could be done in the history books. That man, Mayovsky, up front, he's going to be the firepower that Aberdeen need. However, Celtic, we know how good they are. We know the strengths they possess. Aberdeen are going to need to be on the right game today if they're going to get any result. You can hear the noise. You can hear the fans. Wow, this is going to be some atmosphere. Hamden is sold out for a place in the Scottish Cup final. Let's get in and feel this atmosphere. Come on. Click, click, click. Am I done? <laughs> what end are we on? That's the question. As you can see, we are inside the ground now. This atmosphere is starting to pick up. We've got the Aberdeen fans over here. And then we've got Celtic with a TIFO. This is a chance of an upset for Aberdeen. If they can do this, Scottish football will be shocked. Celtic, they're going to be full of confidence today, especially after Rangers dropping points in midweek. Can they do it? Or are Celtic going to prevail once again and book their place in the Scottish Cup final? What a day it is here at Hamden. It's roasting. And we're in for a cracker. Let's go. 
Look at that Celtic Tifo. Once again, what a display. And here we go. It's Scottish Cup semi final time once again. And look at this Tifo. The stained green glass of Celtic. Look at the colour, look at the detail. The Aberdeen fans are getting the final out. Listen to this, look at this. As the players come over to greet them, listen to this noise. The reception. As the Celtic players to the huddle, this is the passion of Scottish football. the Celtic fans singing the best in Scotland I feel the best in Scotland they're going to need to prevail today it's all on the line we're off what an atmosphere it is in this place both sides straight for the off the pyro's been out wow we are in for a record today at Hamden once again. If Aberdeen can get this first goal, I think this is going to be a fine affair. 12 seconds later. Oh my god, Aberdeen are in! Oh! Wow! Aberdeen have just scored! Wow! Wow! Look at the scenes! Wow! Listen to this place go, what a start. We're red, we're dead, we're bouncing on your head. Well, we're certainly bouncing on Celtic's head just now. They are one the up. Look at this, for a tackle. Honestly, the passion of Scottish football is just different. Every ball means something. Oh, Kiel goes in. Goal. Mistake at the back. And look at these scenes. That's what happens when you make mistakes against Celtic. Kiel will capitalise. It's a shocker of a mistake. And just like that, the champions are level. That's exactly what Aberdeen didn't need to be making mistakes. That was a simple error. Koyo will capitalise, however, it's still one each, it's still all to play for, and Aberdeen need to keep their heads held high. Look at this pyro for the Celtic fans. to play for now. Just talking about Ultras culture. We've got the Aberdeen Ultras over here. They were the original Ultras in this country. The first ever in 1999. You've got the green brigade over there with the boys. What a difference the ultras make to the atmosphere. You can hear them go fence. 90 minutes, they just keep the game going. The atmosphere's ticking. Without the ultras, it would definitely be nowhere near where it is. These ultras, we need to look after them, we need to preserve them, we need to help them. Rather than trying to ban them, rather than trying to keep them out. Because without them, Scottish football wouldn't be half of what it is today. We've seen that T4 the other day with the Celtic fans. 
Abbott for the ultras. Don't know what's happened, but both the screens have went off in Hamden. Both the screens aren't working. And we're working earlier on, so I don't know what's up with them. Might just not have the money to keep them running. <laughs> Typical Scottish football, eh? <laughs> Look at this. This is real hatred. Yoski's in again. Oh my god! Oh wow! This could be a handball here. Put the VAR. It looked as if he flicked it off Skills' hand there. This could be a penalty. VAR checking possible handball. Just before half time. This could be a game changer. No penalty. No penalty given. Five minutes to half time. Apparently it was a handball, it was a clear handball, however, it was just outside the box, so no penalty because it was outside the box, you can't give a free kick. Celtic riding a lot there with that one, but just before half time. Wow. Wow. I love this. It's Celtic looking to take the lead. Oh my god, what was that tackle? Oh, what is she doing? <laughs> just juke being juke in it. Absolute nutter. There we go, half time, what a half it's been, look at the reception, Aberdeen they know they've got nothing left in this season, this is our last chance at Silverware, and what a performance they've put in. It's been a good half, it's been an unbelievable atmosphere, this second half, where both sides are shooting into their respective fans, this is going to be an absolute cracker, and I'm buzzing for it, let's go for the second half. Looks like someone enjoyed our celebration. <laughs> or maybe just didn't want a pie. <laughs> Two pies gone to waste. Shocking behaviour. Well, the TVs are back working again. <laughs> I wonder what was up with them. That's the noise. So quick up pressuring. Just on our sub. Wow. Wow. He always does it here at Hamden, doesn't he? Look at this out again now. It's always going to be crucial getting that goal. But Celtic, they brought on James Forrest, they know the experience he's got. Especially at this venue, it always does it when he comes here. And wow, he's just done it again. He's just come on, he's done the exact same thing about a minute before. Missed it, and he's just got the ball. Cut in, boom, goal. Celtic lead 2 1. Oh my! Mioski just had a clear cut chance there, and a shocking touch. Celtic in now, it is bouncing. Oh my god, Aberdeen are in! What a chance! He has missed it. Miovski was through once again there. Celtic were opened up. And he's taken two wide, he's missed it. What a chance to level it with 10 minutes to go. Oh wow! I'm going to say something now, that was Aberdeen's chance, I don't think they're going to get another chance, especially as good as that, can't be missing that. Right, they've got 10 minutes, they're on their front foot, can they do it? This place seems to think so. Celtic are living on the edge right now. Aberdeen have got them pinned right back. Oh! Talk about putting your body on the line. These two have not been the best, but they put their body on the line where it matters.
somebody needs to find a goal quick. What an effort it's been from the fans to the players on the park. Oh my, what a chance this is. Oh! This was always going to happen. This was never going to be a normal game. And Aberdeen have just run level with minutes to go. My voice is gone. Look at these boys go. Look at this place go now. Oh my god. You cannot beat that. Celtic are pressure in here. Oh my god. Inches for the winner. Surely not. No. Oh my god, man. This is mental. Absolutely mental, man. My heart cannot take this, man. This game has been mental. I know this team is in BBC Scotland, a lot of Aberdeen fans didn't travel down for this, as you can see with the seats here. Listen, anything happens in football, and you've seen that today. Wow. Now Celtic are in. Adam Ida. Oh, Celtic are in. What a block. What a chance, and what a block to win it. This is absolutely crazy. The, one of the craziest games I've ever seen. Wow. There we go. Full time. What a finish to that game. That man, Bojan Bielski, he loves it. He absolutely loves it. And now, Celtic and Aberdeen are going to extra time for a place in the 150th Scottish Cup final. Listen to them now. This whole place is spinning round Celtic and Aberdeen. It's all in the line. 30 minutes and possibly penalties to determine the Scottish Cup finalists. Oh my. Oh my! No way! What a chance! What a chance that is! And he's put it wide. Celtic are in. Oh! Goal! One chance is all you need when you're Celtic, when you've got that quality. And they've done it. They've done it again. Look at this. The Pyro's out. Just before half time, an extra time. That is a crucial goal for Celtic. Look at this. The Celtic fans. Give an Aberdeen fan stick. <laughs> Celtic fans are loving it. They're ahead again. And look at that. As I said to see. Oh, game over. Maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> They're not celebrating. No goal. Oh my. It's a ball. Surely not. Oh my. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I can't take this. 
Please. Perry! VR Trainer Show. VR Trainer. This game has had everything. Everything. We're checking. No penalty. No penalty. Filled by a tank team in the lead up to it. Honestly, man. This is craziness. This is the craziest semi final I've ever been at in my life. Oh my god. What the fuck? You're joking. How is it not free each right now? I don't know. Aberdeen have done it once. Can they do it again? They have got a couple of minutes. We're nearly into the 30 now. 28 minutes, 29 minutes gone. They're pressuring. This is nail biting stuff, man. Oh my god. by spot kicks. I have been to a hundred, over 150 games, probably about 200 in the last year. This is by far, no questions asked, the craziest game I've ever been to. It's had it all, six goals, end to end, two last minute prizes. The atmosphere, we're ready. Can Aberdeen knock out the champions? What an opportunity this is. For the Dons, the players are over. They know how much is at stake. Their last chance at silver well this season. Celtic are up first. It's at this end. Go, go. One 0 Celtic. Listen to the whistles now. The Celtic fans, all round. Look at the Celtic fans. They know how much is at stake. We're Rangers playing tomorrow. McGrath. Yes! Go! Lewis Palmer. What a penalty that is. Wow, that's confidence right there. The star of the show, the guy that's gave the goal away. And then he scored that last minute winner. He plays an extra time. There you go, I'm saying winner, he plays a, I can't even think. My head's gone. Matt O'Reilly. Look at the quality of these penalties, man. Every single one is getting slaughtered. Right down the middle. Safe option. It's three each. Again. <laughs> Another. Oh my god. Wow, that was inches. Fingertips. It's Joe Hart's last season. His last game could possibly be that Scottish Cup final after Celtic won. He'll be wanting to win this more than anybody. Joe Hart right over. Try to get in the penalty taker's face. Save. Save and look at the scenes here. 
Joe Hart, what a save that is. You're having a laugh. Joe Hart's hitting the next penalty. <laughs> is he for real? This man wants to score. He wants to round off his career. With a goal scored for Celtic. Junior Hoyle, the man that came on and made the difference. Dispatched. Now it's sudden death. Alistair Johnson. Good penalty. Send the keeper the wrong way. Now Aberdeen needs to score. He needs to score. Oh my goodness. Inches. What a penalty that is! Wow! The water! He needs to score up! Celtic are through to the Scottish Cup final! Look at these scenes! The Aberdeen players are right over to commiserate the man that missed. The Pyro's out. Do you know what? They cannot fault that effort. What a day it's been here. What a game. What an advert for Scottish football. And Celtic are through to the Scottish Cup final once again. Do you know what? Fair play to both teams. They've just went over, spoke to each other congratulated each other because that was an absolutely outstanding advert for Scottish football unfortunately Aberdeen it wasn't to be their day what an effort but and these fans know it there he is the man that won it all this will be his last semi-final ever. And he's loving it. Well, congratulations to Celtic. They are in the Scottish Cup final in June. Thank you for joining me in on this one. If you've not already, click that subscription button and I will see you in the next one.